modern scientific adventure actually began more than 100 years ago. That's when one of the most famous naval battles of modern times was fought during the Civil War. The iron-plated Merrimack of the South against the all-iron monitor of the North. Unfortunately, after the Civil War, the monitor sank in a storm somewhere off the coast of North Carolina. One hundred years later, scientists at last located it on the bottom. Not long after, the U.S. National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration began an expedition to recover this historic ship. They sent down a remote-controlled vehicle with a TV camera, which revealed the monitor upside down on the bottom. Next, small submarines called submersibles were launched for a closer look at the wreck. They took detailed pictures to help plan for the main part of the project, sending divers inside the monitor during the next phase, some two years later. This time, the submersibles were used to take divers down to the sea floor. They found the monitor was overgrown with coral and sponges. In fact, it had become an artificial reef. Like a natural reef, it attracted fish, including a large grouper they nicknamed Sam. Fortunately, Sam was not dangerous, but was curious about the divers, who began to feed him. They surveyed the entire wreck, from the stern to the famous gun turret. They concentrated on a small section that was once the captain's cabin to collect what they could. They discovered the ship had been weakened from years of corrosion and from what appeared to be an explosion from a World War II depth charge. They concluded the monitor could not survive a trip to the surface. As soon as artifacts were sent topside, scientists went to work. Each item was photographed, cataloged, and stored in plastic buckets filled with seawater. You see, after 115 years underwater, the artifacts would decompose rapidly if exposed to the air without special treatment. The items collected were taken to a laboratory on the shore. There, they were carefully cleaned and examined. Today, in museums, you can see the precious naval artifacts, pieces of history reclaimed and preserved by the scientists of the Monitor Expedition.